So there's a physical universe and reality and even the preservation of the entity of your life. If you see you're going down a path of being someone you're not or crafting who you're not and putting that out, that's a should not be. Social media, you tell them your authentic stories. You tell them all your business and all your dirty laundry to get likes. Like, why are you telling the world this? There's something that doesn't smell right about it. <laughs> none of us are the best looking or none of us are the smartest. Like, none of that. It's good to know that. And then you just be true. Be yourself. It's so good because it really points to the question, how do I know if I'm where I should be in life? Be right here with this step. And if you're calculating your image on social media, if you're overthinking about what's this post going to look like, what am I going to say? You're crafting an image, like a self image, like the golden cow in the story of Moses. It's idolatry, right? It's worshiping of self and getting others to worship that self. But notice that because that's where you don't want to be. If you're living like that, calculating, crafting, managing perceptions. That's a place to say, wait, pause. I'm going somewhere that I should not be. I actually just get present right here, my feet right here. If I'm walking down the street in San Francisco at 2 a.m., I should not be there. <laughs> so there's a physical universe and reality and even the preservation of the entity of your life. There's danger or threat. But then there's the ego side. If you see you're going down a path of being someone you're not or crafting who you're not and putting that out, that's a should not be. We know that before anyone else knows it. We know if we pause, get present, wake up, kind of know, wait, I'm not being true right here. Why? Because I want people to like me or I don't want to look foolish or I don't want to look stupid or I want to look good. I want to look like I have it all together. Or I want to look like the Joneses. But what y'all want to remember is the Joneses are very screwed up people. Nothing is as it seems. And with this biblical quote of do not conform to the patterns of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind from within. And these kind of conversations I think support that transformation from within and the connection to your creator and something greater than ourselves.